Ming? Ming? Where did this word come from? Do you know? Do you think it's important to know where Chinese characters come from? I think this is important for people who speak Chinese as a second language. Because you can see it more clearly this way and it's less likely to be confused. Ming, in Oracle Bone inscriptions has a Ko shape on the left, which represents a person's mouth. On the right is the word Xi, which means when the sun is about to set and the moon is about to appear. We all know that in the evening in dust, we cannot see clearly the specific appearance of a person. Therefore, the entire glyph for Ming represents the fact that in a blurry evening hours, people cannot see other people's faces, so people call his name to confirm. Therefore, the original meaning of Ming is to call a person by his or her name. Later, Ming could also refer to a person's name, such as Ming Zi, name, Xing Ming, name. When Ming is used as a verb, it means naming. For example, Ming Ming, naming, Qu Ming, naming. Later, Ming was extended to the name of various things, such as Ming Wu, name, which refers to the name and shape of the object, and Ming Cheng, name. In addition, Ming is also used as fame, reputation, such as Cheng Wei Ming Ren, becoming a celebrity, Hao De Ming Sheng, good reputation, Zhu Ming Ren Shi, famous person, Wei Le Chu Ming, in order to be famous, Wei Hu Ming Yu, to maintain reputation. Have you learned it? Learning Chinese character is very meaningful because it is like a picture. If you want to truly understand and speak Chinese, you can check out my other Chinese courses and VIP programs. If you have any questions or suggestions, please send me an email. I will solve your problem and adapt your suggestions as soon as possible. See you next time. Bye-bye.